Hi and welcome to our project Ultra Perception Science Goes Pop. We are here putting together two spreads of our six research-based pop-up spreads that bring science to life through awe and wonder, art and technology. Last year, after an intense process of pitching ideas and gathering votes, we were successful in acquiring funding from Kinetic. Kinetic is a scheme from the ANU that's funded by the School of Physics, the Compton School and Makerspace. And it's a wonderful opportunity for people like us, for other teams like us who have game-changing ideas to pitch for competitive funding. Yeah, so we were successful in finding funding to create a prototype of what hopefully will become um, the ultimate beautiful research-based pop-up book series that is accompanied by an augmented reality app. So the idea is to create a new science experience and really a new method and result of science communication. We envision a series of books that will be available in bookshops across Australia. And what we really think it's going to be like is a reimagination of the book as a sort of traditional tome or this physical object that contains knowledge. Instead, what we're looking at is a colorful, engaging, technology-powered voyage of discovery. A tool for intergenerational learning and discovery. So in other words, we really want to create the, an outrageously bold and um, fantastically adventurous format that makes you understand new things about the universe and that you really want to have, that you want to collect, that you want to share with your family, your gang, your friends. And um, that's a science galore. That is the Lady Gaga of science and the ultimate science experience. Absolutely. And to that effect, we have been collaborating with scientists from the ANU to create six original spreads each of which could be then rolled out to be a book uh, in its own right. Four of these spreads have been made by Canberra visual artist Dr. Hannah Hoyne, but to give you some idea of what the project will look like when it manifests, you'll see some examples of the two spreads made by Anna Sophie. Yeah, so here we have our introductory spread. It was developed together with Dr. Laura Dawes, a historian of medicine, and it really embodies the spirit of our project. It's about discovery, new perspectives, surprising insights. And you see a microscope as a symbol of science that is really like a portal to a new universe. It takes us into small universes and teaches us a lot about ultra complex and really important complex issues and connections. So um, we start our project with this spread and you can find out more on our website. But um, in addition to our introductory spread, we have five specifically science-themed spreads that all start with a did-you-know element. And this one is about parasites and the fact that parasites may have a bad reputation, but at the same time, they are super important for our ecosystem. They teach us a lot about their hosts, including us, and they are used as medicine. And um, this spread was developed with Alex Meyer from the ANU, a parasitologist, um, really to show the wonderfulness of parasites. As well as working with scientists across the ANU, we've collaborated with a Canberra-based animation company called Eye Candy to really bring these pages to life. We believe that this combination of augmented reality and science with color is going to be exciting and interesting to anyone who's interested in science or curious about new technologies. And uh, we really think this is the way of the future. Yeah, it's a deliciously, deliciously <laughs> weird delicious, science experience. Deliciously weird, yes. yeah. So we are Dr. Terhi Nurmekofola and Dr. Anna Sophie Jürgens. And we would like to thank the Kinetic team and the Makerspace for creating and making possible such a wonderfully different and experimental and innovative project. We would like to thank our scientists, our artist, Dr. Hannah Hoyn. Um, her four spreads will blow you away. And we also thank everyone involved in this project in, within these different stages and um, iterations. If you like what you see and if you like to find out more, maybe even try the app, come and visit us on open day on 16th of March at the ANU.